back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are brand new. I have been wanting to do this video for the past three weeks and I have not had time and then I was finally like, okay, if I want to do something, I make time for it. So I am so excited for this video. As you guys can tell by the title, it is recreating three Pinterest outfits that I am totally obsessed with. I have all my outfits laid out and I'm going to actually be going out like in the town and downtown and stuff like that and be taking like try to take like the exact same photos that they took like i said i feel like i did pretty good with kind of matching the outfits and putting like my own twist to it in a way because i don't have everything the exact same but i tried so we're gonna go through all the outfits and then i'm gonna insert clips of me in downtown and taking these photos and that sort of thing and how the outfits look on me if you're new to my channel don't forget to subscribe and click the bell i post every tuesday and friday but i've been posting a lot more because i have some more time don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up it helps me out a lot to know what you guys want to see and be sure to follow my social medias which are on the screen i post all of these outfit photos on instagram i'm really active on instagram my tiktok is really active i style outfits on there snapchat twitter all that fun stuff so be sure to catch up with me on my other platforms and i will try to link all this stuff down below in order like the outfits so you guys are able to shop these items and without further ado let's go ahead and get started because your girl is so pumped i am so excited i feel like this is probably like my favorite video i'm gonna film on my channel we'll see but so far so good so i'm gonna go ahead and throw up on the screen the very first photo that i'm trying to recreate slash imitate um i feel like i did really good on this outfit specifically because i didn't have the shorts i didn't have the crop top she was wearing like the sports bra but i had similar items that kind of went along with it so i feel like this outfit is pretty pretty similar so in the photo she took she's wearing some nike like woven shorts that are like men's with a big nike check i don't have those but i have these from the crypt and they are sweat shorts so they're like the same material really nice big and baggy and like boyish kind of so these are just plain black so these are the shorts that i'm going to be wearing i have every color in these i love them so much they're super practical so i highly recommend picking these up i have them in a size medium so for the top she's wearing like a sports bra i don't have that exact one but i have this off-white one with nike but i picked it from StockX, and this is the one that i'm going to be wearing for this fit and i don't know i feel like this is actually a little bit better because i like the writing on this a little bit more but this is this top and then for the jacket she was just wearing a plain like black zip up like cropped um and i don't have that either so i have this nike kind of swoosh windbreaker that's cropped and i feel like this is just like super similar so far this is the outfit i feel like we're doing really good and i also have the same exact shoes so this outfit's a hit so she's obviously wearing high nike socks so i have those to put on but for the shoes i got these from request boutique i will link them down below these are called the satin black toes and these are the exact shoes she's wearing and i just picked these up two weeks ago so it's kind of a coincidence that i'm doing this video but i haven't worn them out yet i've worn them for like like inside and to try them on but i haven't worn them like in a photo yet so I'm excited to wear them but they are just like a satin leather on the back red bottoms and then black everywhere else so this outfit is going to be fire i'm super excited and i don't know if i mentioned but this is like the streetwear edition of like recreating pictures outfits because i'm like a very streetwear person okay so now i'm gonna go ahead and insert the clips of me downtown or wherever i'm going um, around town to try and take this exact photo a similar photo and show you guys the outfit on me let me know down below after this video is done what outfit was your favorite and also how you think i did with kind of putting the outfits together if i didn't have everything from that certain outfit okay guys so we're in my second outfit and we were driving and the way this girl took the photo was literally on like a garage ledge like this and i was driving in downtown and i was like oh, there's a ledge i literally swerved so quick and i was like okay so this is exactly where this next little series is going to be taken obviously i have my little thing set up for my photo so i'm just kind of getting the angle that i want right now so i'm just gonna like figure that out first it needs to be like a lot closer for sure oh. well there goes my car keys so it's exciting do you want me to tell them Face after I those. No. If you're oh. seeing this, you're beautiful. I love you, Bella. You're beautiful. Well, I'm gonna be sitting up. Look, you like my fat roll? Yummy. Anybody else have fat roll when they sit? But when they stand up, they don't have it. Cause same. See how fat I look in these photos. Slow metabolism check. Can't really. I guess it just needs to be more centered, like more straight on. <laughs> Am I sweating? Um, just like 20 pounds, 20 pounds or weight. <laughs> Oh yes, yes, yes. Sunglass marks, don't I? Yeah, a little. Yeah, a little. Okay, so this lady we're taking place is at, I think her name is Thea or Theo. That's what her um, niece calls her. We're at her little area and she came out here and let us come in for a second and give us water. She was literally the sweetest thing ever. And little people like that like make my day and make me so happy and like 
oh, she's so sweet. So she's letting us take our photos out here. I was like, are you sure we're allowed to take photos out here? Cause I've been so paranoid, but I'm just gonna finish taking my photos. I think we took a couple photos like this though. Okay, it's starting to get cool outside, which is so nice, but I'm gonna go ahead and insert the photos of her outfit and then mine. I feel like I did this one a little bit, like more justice than my last one, but I also made like five TikToks out here. So be sure to follow my TikTok and shout out to Keegan, Keegan Kamara. She's been helping me this whole time. And I love you so much, Keegan. Love you more. Okay, so for the next outfit, I'm gonna go ahead and throw it up on the screen. This is a trend I've been seeing everywhere with the tennis skirts, and I am so here for it. I posted a photo on my Instagram of me wearing my UNC Obsidians, and I had the matching skirt, and it was such a vibe. So I love the tennis skirt trend, and I picked up one the other day from Princess Polly, and it's, I think it's sold out now. I'm not really sure. I'll try to link it if I can. But it's super similar to the one the girl's wearing in the photo, so it's perfect. But I don't know. I feel like I've never been a person to like layer things and have like a collar kind of sticking through but i tried it on this morning when i was putting these outfits together and i was like why do i actually kind of like this so um for this next outfit we've got this cute little nike top this is going to go under our sweatshirt that i'm going to be showing you guys in just a few moments but i picked this for up from the app a few months ago like three months ago so I'll try my best to find it if I'm able to. It's kind of like a crop polo. It has a Nike check down here and the little zipper detail up here. And it's been really hard to style this for me, not gonna lie. But then when I saw the photo, I was like, wait, I have a colored like shirt that I could kind of wear. And this is coming in handy. So I'm gonna see if I can style it alone, but I haven't worn this yet, like with just like this whole thing showing. Um, I don't know why I feel like a cropped collar top is a little bit hard to style for me. So for our layering piece, I've talked about this in a few videos before, but it's just a Nike sweatshirt. I picked this up from Kohl's. Um, I was like really cold one night when I was studying at school and there was a Kohl's across the street. So I went and picked up a hoodie and this has become an essential in my closet. I just did a closet essentials. I'll link it down below for you guys to watch, but it's literally become something that I'm always wearing. I'm always styling and I'm always finding a new outfit to wear it with. So it's just plain, it's super simple. It's in a size large because it's men's and I wanted it like to be super oversized But this is going to go on top of that collared shirt and obviously through the top of it You'll see like the little collared neck for the skirt. We have this princess Polly skirt It is from lioness the size medium and it just has pleats on it and I love the quality of this so much. It's super nice quality super thick But it's not like one of those cheap skirts. So it's perfect I know it's gonna last me a long time and it's also like I said coming in very handy for this video So these are our bottom for this outfit. So for the shoes, she had a pair of Air Force One shadows on I don't have that exact one, but I do have Air Force One shadows. This is the color sapphire I picked these up from StockX. I am utterly obsessed with these shoes I love like the latex over here the plain leather the double everything. They're just like my favorite so these are the shoes I'm gonna be wearing in this section of the video for this outfit I think that they're good pops of color for this outfit too for accessories. She has sunglasses on I don't have those exact ones, but I have these ones from key or quay Australia I think it's key um, and these are called the drama by days. I think they're discontinued I got these on like a weird app not like a weird app like a reseller app because I really love these sunglasses and I wanted an extra pair but these are drama by day and they're just like black super bougie super like don't look at me and these are the ones I'm gonna be wearing for this outfit she also had a really nice big chain necklace on and I don't have that exact one obviously but I got this one for Christmas it just says LV and it has like a Nike swoosh and I thought like how fitting is this to wear for this video when I'm wearing Nike shoes a Nike like windbreaker type of sweatshirt thing so this is going to be my accessory for my neck I am so excited for this outfit it's like I said not a vibe I would typically go for so I'm glad I'm like expanding my fashion sense but let's go ahead and insert the video and photos of me trying to recreate this outfit in the post here is the outfit everybody so this is how I take my Instagram photos if anybody was wondering I have a tripod and it has a little clicker so literally I just hold this in my hand and I hide it and that's how I take all my Instagram photos. So it is so insanely hot out here, but we're vibing, we're doing this. So in that first photo, the girl has a pole beside her, I think, so that's what we're gonna try to imitate in this photo. Um, I don't know if it's gonna be exact, but I'm gonna try and take these pics. Here's the final outfit. And I showed you guys my sunglasses, but it's way too hot to wear sunglasses right now. And I had my necklace on that I showed you guys, and then I pulled it and it broke, so. I love that for me so much, so let's see if I can try and take these photos. Mine's going to be a little bit more of an angle than hers and a lot more sweaty. Okay, there's got to be at least one good one out of all those. I'm praying, I hope. These 
these are so pretty I keep looking at them and oh my goodness the white against white it's really popping right now isn't it so there's got to be some good ones in here for the gram okay I think we have some good ones for this outfit I don't know if they're exactly like hers sorry I'm blotting my sweat but I think I did pretty good we did this wall and then we did this one right here on the corner it's like a yellow kind of tint one and that's kind of what she had in hers so Hopefully they're good. I'm gonna go ahead and insert hers versus mine that I picked. I think the outfit was pretty on point. I think the only thing that might have been just kind of a little off was the photo. So let's switch to the next outfit. Okay, and for the very last outfit, this is something that I haven't styled quite like recently, like an oversized graphic tee with some nice baggy jeans, but I am excited because I have been wanting to style something like this for a very long time and today is the perfect opportunity. So I'm going to go ahead and insert the photo of the outfit I'm trying to implement and create. If I'm not mistaken, the photo is by Chrissy and I love her Instagram content so much. Uh, she's like one of the fashion people I actually do look up to. Other than, otherwise, like I just kind of go with what I feel. I love all her fits so much and I felt really inspired by this one because I had super similar pieces. So let's go ahead and get on to what this outfit consists of. In the photo, she's wearing a long sleeve blue type of top but I don't have that. So I'm just going to improvise with this shirt from Urban Outfitters. It is a Poetic Justice Tupac shirt and I have it in size small, medium. I'll link it down below for you guys to shop. I love it so much. I think the colors are beautiful. And I don't know, I'm really into graphic tees right now. I'm also kind of into tie-dye. So I feel like this shirt kind of grabs it all. And for the bottoms, we have these jeans from The Crypt. I'm actually gonna switch these out for a size large because I mean like these fit, but I want these to be super, super baggy and these kind of fit a little too tight for me. But I think these are called the Damien jeans, if I remember correctly. But they are just like a light wash and they go into just really big bottoms down here. So I do have them rolled twice because I'm really short. The left leg has two big slits in it, which I love. I think that adds definitely like a very nice like edgy streetwear type of vibe. And the denim is super nice and soft. It's not like too stretchy, so I would just kind of go true to size or size up in these. But I love the material of these jeans. They're super nice and thin and breathable. And for the shoes of my final and third outfit, I have the same exact one she's wearing. These are the Jordan 1 Royal Toes. I picked these up on StockX. I think that these are so beautiful. And I haven't worn these yet. I got these two days ago. So I'm excited to wear these. It all is just like a full on vibe with this outfit. I love all the minor monochromatic blues. They did come with blue laces, but I just preferably wanted black on these. And I'm just really excited for this outfit because I've been wanting like baggy jeans, the baggy shirt, and Jordans. All right, and I'm gonna go ahead and insert the clips of me trying on this outfit and doing my little thing with this outfit. Okay guys, we're in the final and third outfit. I have my royal toes on. I've got the crib jeans like I talked about earlier and this Urban Outfitters shirt. The camera angle is like this for now because we wanna make sure like it's gonna be a little bit lower because I wanna take floor pictures, but we're in the heart of downtown right now. No one's here because we're filming this on a Sunday, but time to take some more pictures. I've been making so many TikToks too. I'm proud of myself for like multitasking, but it's hot. I feel like my makeup looks trashy. So we're just gonna continue to take these and hopefully they turn out good. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and insert the photos of me in this outfit and then the other girl in the outfit. That's it for this video. I had so much fun. I definitely want to do this video again. So if you guys have other sort of Pinterest outfits, DM me them on Instagram because like I said, I would love to do them. Such a fun time. Stay tuned for all the Instagram photos. I am so excited. And like I said, I made TikTok videos like poses and all that fun stuff to do. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love you guys so much. Stay happy, be positive, and just remember that if someone ever tries to imitate you, they literally can't because there's only one of you in this whole entire world and nobody can ever take that place. I love you guys so much and I'll see you guys in my very next video. Bye guys.